Well, we had a call about a fox cub which is stuck in the fence. The lady's seen the mother there and everything's well apart from this cub which has got stuck. So we shouldn't need a lot of kit. Hopefully it's going to be a rescue release. So we'll just take the basic, hope we don't need any more. Hello. Oh, it's this way, is it? Okay. Just by that big pot. Okay. Oh, I can see. Head. Yeah. And there's other cubs there as well, you say? There's four or five underneath you. Uh -oh. It's all right. You'll be fine. <laughs> They're not going to hurt you. Sorry, sorry. They're I'm tiny. Sorry. I'm, I'm scared. Of They're more scared to you. I've got a bigger bite than that fox cub, I'll tell you. Go and have a look, Jake. Right, let's go and have a have deco. A no, sorry. All right, darling. Okay, well, as often happens, um, fox cubs and hedgehogs, all sorts of things, get stuck in chain link fence. It's quite interesting, the cubs there, but it looks as if the earth is under here. So it's been more scrubbled out, I suspect. That's where they're living, under the patio, which is quite cool. So it's close to home. Are you going to be able to get it out? Yes. Oh, good. Wow. These fences do cause a nightmare to hedgehogs, fox cubs and every other thing. What I would do, or try and do when I've done it, He's tried to just block that bit up with something so it can't go yeah. through there again. We'll get this one out first. All right, little girl. All right, now. Well, why did you get round there? That's silly, isn't it? Eh? You got all stuck. All right, little girl. All right, the wire's cut. I'm just going to bend that piece of wire out of the way. And there we have a fox cub. He's probably going to try to bite me. I want to make sure it's ne neck's not marked. I'm wearing gloves so there's no human scent on me, though they're quite big now, so it shouldn't matter. How and old is he? Uh, it's probably about six or seven weeks old. But you're cool. Right. Yeah, he's absolutely fine. You're going to go home? Go on, you're going home. Off you go. Go on. Where are you going? I'm going along there and straight under that hole. That was really textbook. No problem. A really nice little release goes back to his mum and dad and we'll be absolutely fine. That's a lovely it's sight to see, you should enjoy it. Yeah, it's lovely yeah, to I see. Know, I know, I know. If but because I'm not really used to it, I'm from Singapore, we don't have all this wildlife. You're in England yeah, now. I know, I know. I appreciate you it. You don't get more wild than I am. Oh, it's my birthday today. Oh, it's, happy it's, birthday. it's my day off. Oh. Yeah, but it looks like you really enjoyed it. I love what I do. I love what I do. I'm going to see if I can just cover up this area a bit better so the fox doesn't try to go through there again. That's sort of secure. I promise you to be braver, Simon. Be brave. <laughs> OK. Bye. Take Thanks. care. Bye. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks again. If you like our videos, click on the subscribe button. Every new subscriber means we can save more wildlife. <laughs>